Today is a reading vlog. The challenge this week is to read five books, starting with Lock Every Door, which I'm genuinely terrified to read. Then there's Five Total Strangers, which I'm really excited for this one. It seems thrillerish. Then Killjoy, which is the prequel to A Good Girl's Guide to Murder, which is the one I'll be starting with. Let's go to my cabin. Killjoy has been really amazing so far. It's been kind of spooky, matching the vibes of Clue, and I don't know, it's been pretty great so far. I finished Killjoy, which was absolutely amazing. Five stars, definitely recommend. Time to read Five Total Strangers. Why did I think I could read this at 11 o'clock at night when everyone else is asleep and the whole house is dark? That was a big mistake. This book is the definition of anxiety and I don't know how to feel about that. Pretty invested. Uh, I think I'm gonna continue tomorrow so I can actually fall asleep and not be terrified the entire night. Hey guys, so I have been reading all morning. I am on my second book of the week, which is Five Total Strangers. It's been really cool so far. I've been flying through the book. Yeah, I'm almost done. I finished the book and now that the sun has set, it is time for Lock Every Door. Which is scarier, the book or? <laughs> Hey guys, so it's night once again, and I am terrified to read this because everyone's going to bed. It's gonna be quiet in the house. I don't wanna die. Paranormal things scare me way more than thrillers. Wish me luck. Hey guys, I finished Lock Every Door. For me, this is a four out of five stars. I know everyone else gives this a five stars, but the only thing is I suspected a lot of the things that happened, which took away the element of surprise. But overall, it was absolutely amazing. Very thriller. Yeah, it was pretty great. Uh, time to move on to my next book, which is an Agatha Christie mystery. I don't know. Okay guys, so I have been reading Five Little Pigs and I'm making a mystery video right now actually and you guys can go watch that on my channel. It's either about to come out or it's on its way to come out. I actually don't know. It should be pretty great. I'm solving this mystery. I've written so many notes on this book. This book has taken the longest time ever to read just because I'll even just spend like 20 minutes just sitting with the book open, just contemplating. They have done it. Could this person be the murderer? Yeah, it's been, it's been really great so far. This is my first Agatha Christie novel. I'm actually really happy that I read it. I tried reading it last year, but I couldn't really get into it for some reason. I don't know. That was like when I really read a lot of fantasy. But yeah, I'm starting to like to some new sort of things, so... Maybe this is my first of many Agatha Christie books. It's one that not a lot of people have actually heard of. Maybe it'll inspire you to read it as well.
with the conclusion of Five Little Pigs, I think I'm going to read a different book rather than the one that I picked for my fifth book. Because basically what happened is my friend came over today and we just rewatched the original movie Twilight. We were laughing the whole time, but we also love it at the same time. <laughs> it's so bad, but you know, like in a good way, you know? It has inspired me to reread the books. It's been three or four years since I've read the books. At the time, I was absolutely obsessed. They're so well written. I might be reading that for my fifth book. I know it's supposed to be a thriller, scary book reading vlog, but well, there's vampires. I'm totally reading a thriller. read this i just want to say thank you so much for watching this video go watch my other reactions and videos on my channel and go pick up a dang book of your own